I've spent zero microtransactions in Dragon's Dogma 2, and the game has been a blast. I get the performance, but honestly, it's worth it. Yeah, I, I mean, for me, I just think I don't want to fall into the trap of demanding boycotts for every game, because then I feel like boycotts lose their potency and meaning. And if we just start demanding boycotts of every single game that has any sort of DLC, we're going to start to miss out on some of the best games ever, because these studios put that stuff in because the executives and corporate bigwigs are demanding it. And honestly, I would much rather they do it the way that Capcom did it with Dragon's Dogma 2 than the way Ubisoft tends to do it with in-game stores, XP boosts, and things like that. And they did it in Resident Evil 4 make two and nobody complained about it you're right i think we brought it up a couple times but it was not a scandal whatsoever so it seems to me like some special pleading where it's like well i'm particularly upset about this case because it's not resident evil 4 and i really like resi 4 but this game i'm not that stoked on so i'm fine with boycotting this one it's like okay dude 